prekinuo saradnju, to ružno zvuči, mislim, završio saradnju sa Marijanom i Džidžijem i Miljanom nekako u različitim vremenskim intervalima, nisam imao priliku da nekako ih sve okupim na jednom mestu i da nekako upriličim sve to i da obeležim jednu eru koju smo provjeli zajedno, ipak smo napravili velike stvari u svetu tenisa i dugujem veliku zahvalnost, pa sam eto iskoristio priliku danas da ih okupim i da im dam neki znak pažnje i da oni budu danas sa nama. Evo, možda Maroš, you want to say a few words? Dobar dan. Happy Easter. Uh, sorry, I will speak English, and uh, first of all, uh, I would like to thank you, uh, Nole, what you have done for me for the uh, last past 15 years, and uh, it was a great journey, and I really enjoy most of the time. <laughs> <laughs> Half of the time, Half of the time yeah. But, uh, secondly, I want to thank the uh, Djokovic family that they picked me up and they, they basically trust in me uh, at the beginning when they choose me. Then I would like to thank my family for supporting me because without them I wouldn't stand here uh, today. <laughs> and the last, uh, I, I thank you myself for enduring it. <laughs> uh, that I always stand by Novak's side at his, in his most important life decision. Thank you very much. Hvala vam puno. Hvala, Maroš. The next person, Gepard Grič, please come. GG. Yeah, of course, fitness trainer for a long time. Phil Grič. Big part of all of the success that Novak Djokovic has had. Hello, happy Easter everybody. I'm very pleased to be here. Generally, I, I think the most important thing I want to say is I always enjoyed the time here in Belgrade. We had great, great training sessions. Also, I have to apologize to Novak and to Jelena for being sometimes too tough to him. And when he came home, maybe he had a tough time with his wife. <laughs> Sometimes. Myself, compared to, to Marian, obviously, I didn't stay that long. I only stayed 10 years. Marian was 15 years. This is incredible. But I enjoyed every year, I enjoyed every minute. And, you know, we all became a big family through good times, through bad times, and again, I have to say thank you to Novak, thank you to the Djokovic family, and thank you to Barry Gray. Thank you. Yeah, no Novak Djokovic incidentally calling these three guys, Nikola Pilic as well, will come up, the three musketeers. Milja Novanovic, predstavnik Srbije u ovom timu. He's honored to have them all here in Belgrade. Mention that they are his family. Christos Vaskrse, Sretan Uskrs svima. Pokušat ću da budem kratak. Želeo bi Novak u njegovoj porodici porodici koju je formirao ovaj tim, da zahvalim na svim ovih, na svih ovih 15 godina koji smo proveli zajedno. 15 godina 
poprilično onako dugo, a istovremeno deluje da je bilo jako kratko i prošlo. Želeo bi da vam zahvalim na svim ovim lepim trenucima koje smo proveli svi zajedno i nadam se Novače da ćeš nastaviti i dalje da... Da igraš. Hvala vam svima. Hvala vam. That's Miljan Amanovic. Just a few words. koji mi je mnogo milo videti nakon, eto, puno godina, moj teniski otac, Nikola Pilić. And of course, one of the legends of the sport, former French Open finalist, Nikola Pilić, US Open winner in the doubles, back in 1970. Djokovic calling Nikola Pilic his tennis father. Izuzetna mi je čast da sam ovde. Jedna mala korekcija. He is not one of the best all the time. He is the best all the time. U konkurenciji Federera, Nadala, Mareja i društvom 366 sedmica da budeš broj jedan. To je više od sedam godina. Po mom skromnom ubjeđenju možda će trebati tisuću godina da se taj rekord obori. Srđan i Dijana, moju suprugu i mene, tretirao kao familiju. I hoću kazati jednu stvar da mi je... Evo vidite. Kad prođeš 80 godina, onda su emocije još i veće. I zato kažem, Novak, ovo je jedna, imam 60 godina iskustva. Ovo je jedna od najboljih publika što sam ja u svom životu vidio. Još jedna rečenica, vi možete biti ponosni da u ovoj državi postoji jedan kao što je Novak Đoković. I nije mi jasno zašto ne mogu normalno da govorim. Sa Novakom sam vezan i želim mu sve najbolje za mene, a nisam subjektivan. On je najbolji igrač svih vremena. Moram reći još jednu stvar. Srđan Đoković i ja smo uvijek mislili da Novak će biti veliki šampion. I to je bio godinama i ostaje godinama, a što je najvažnije, on je odličan čovjek.
Žao mi je što danas nije dobio čestitan Rubljevu koji je igrao fantastično. Nemojmo zaboraviti da on je šesti, sedmi igrač svijeta. I da je Novak igrao prvi dan tri seta, drugi dan tri seta, treći dan tri seta. Bio je bolestan i ovako kako se borio svaka mu čast. Hvala vam lijepa na svemu. Well, just to run through, Nikola Pilic was saying there, Novak's parents have treated me as a, a, a family member throughout my life. And this is the best crowd I saw. You, know, you have to be proud to have Novak Djokovic. He is the best of all time. His father and I, we always thought he would be number one. It's a, a special moment for Djokovic and the Djokovic family. And what he considers to be his outer family as well. But of course, at the end of it all, it is Andre Rublev who was able to upset the world number one in the final. Rublev winning his 11th ATP Tour title, his first here in Belgrade. Bila je ovo usputna stanica ka još većim izazovima. Još jednom aplauz za Andreja Rubljeva. I'm sure that is a, a photo he will have put up somewhere in his house. First ever time he's been able to get the better of a world number one player and the first ever time he's been able to get the better of Novak Djokovic. A brilliant tournament for Rublev. As I say, opening round match against Yuri Lehechka, he was really struggling. Dropped the first set, he was under pressure, had to save a number of break points. Once he turned that match around, he did not look back. Uh, of course, when you consider Wimbledon's recent decision, the emotions that he might have had off the court all throughout this week and what he's had to deal with with that situation certainly means that his week has ended on the biggest of highs here at the Serbia Open. It's his third clay court title as well. Gives him a, a fair amount of form to take into Madrid and Rome, which are just a, over a week away now, Madrid. We were wondering at the start of the week, had Djokovic lost early, whether he would play Munich. But I think it's safe to say he will now probably have a week off before heading to Madrid. Novak i Niki Pilić, ne zaboravite da je Niki Pilić pomogao i Davis Cup reprezentaciji Srbije da osvoji titulu. Hvala Niki za sve. So that concludes what has been a, a fantastic week, a fantastic day. Naomi Cavadé's birthday has been there as well. Uh, have you had a good birthday, Naomi? Oh, it's been excellent. What a final that was. Such a treat. It's been an incredible tournament. Thoroughly enjoyed it from start to finish. And it, it's just... There's chances everywhere now, aren't there? Even for Rublev to take out the world number one. Yeah, it's been a, a fantastic week. Uh, Novak Djokovic falling just a little short in the final, but I'm sure the world number one will take away far more positives than negatives from the week. But what a week it has been for Andre Rublev playing some quite simply stunning tennis. But from Naomi Cavadate, from Barry Milnes, and from everyone who works so hard behind the scenes here in Belgrade, and myself, Peter Rogers, we say goodbye. Dame i gospodo, čovek koji ne zaboravlja ni na koga, Novak Đoković.